Yo, what's going on guys? This is Mickey CTX, known as P on you underscore Mickey on PS3 or P on you space Mickey on Xbox 360. Uh, pardon my delay on some videos. I've been really busy this weekend and also pardon the fact that um, I don't know. I, I forgot in the very beginning of this video while I was recording on my HD PVR uh, to keep up with the score. So I took the liberty of, uh, of just writing everything down in the beginning and you know, I, I, you know, I did a pretty good game, and uh, this is mainly a, a clan battle. Uh, it's uh, P on you versus, I think it was called DS. Uh, it was one of the challenges, and uh, they wanted to do uh, an objective game, so we chose domination. And um, so we um, we played them a few times, and uh, so you know, we, we showed them what we're about as as a clan. You know, we uh, we're rushers, but yet at the same time we have our defenders. You know, and uh, we've we prefer just rushing, but uh, they kind of camped in the beginning. Right here, you'll see them trying to bum rush B and uh, me defending it, of course. Uh, I think B is an extremely important uh, flag, uh, especially on, on, on this map. Uh, launches, it's, just, it's very easy to get B back, but yet it's so hard to get, to get it back if you lose it. So uh, our objective was just to keep B as, um, as long as possible. And as you can see, I moved away from here because it was going to be noob tube. If you get noob tube once, chances are he's going to noob tube you too. You know, again. So uh, I always move away, especially in that area because it ricochets or it could, uh, it could explode on the wall and kill you. So the smart thing to do in that case is move up, move out the way and try, you know, hope for the best. Um, my gameplay here, I think at this time, I, I think I was at, uh, I, don't remember, I don't recall if I was at 7 kills or 8. And I had, I think, like 4 deaths or 3 deaths. I know my uh, my final score was 23 and I think 13. Uh, it's not it's not the, it's not the most impressive game, but again, it was a clan battle. Um, you know, despite the fact that we lost one of our members and it was six against five, uh, we did pretty well. I mean, I think we 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 killed the other team by more than 100 points. So, you know, <laughs> in any case, that's a, in any uh, kind of challenge, that's extremely good. Uh, you can see, you can see, he got a triple kill off that one noob tube. I hate noob tubers with a passion. It's just, you know, it, they they were trying to lower it down for black ops, but it seems that it didn't really work. Um, people still get, you know, uh, triple kills on these noob tubes, and especially on claymores. I those things really tick me off. And uh, I don't know, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but some of the guns, like the infield and and the sniper gun, lately. I, I mean, I've been reading about it and I've heard about it that they've been kind of stronger and more accurate on accurate on on, on uh, sniping gun. But um, I've been noticing that that a lot of guns are now better than they were. Like the Uzi, for example, I was actually very accurate the other day, which I have an Uzi only gameplay that I'm gonna post up later. Um, so I, I, I don't know. I, I think uh, I think Black Ops is uh, not Black Ops. Uh, Treyarch is finally understanding that. A lot of the things they did in the beginning was kind of messed up. Like, a lot of people were mad, mad about the whole, you know, quick scoping thing. I'm not a quick scoper, but, you know, I don't condone it. You know, if you're going to be quick scoping, that's fine. Um, as long as you're not camping, I kind of wish they, they. I mean, I would condone camping as a as a gamer. And, uh, <laughs> and I just, like that guy there. You know, I, I don't I don't like campers. It's just that's just my philosophy. Uh, if you got to be around waiting for people to show up, then hey, man, you. You should be playing like Search and Destroy or something, you know. Um, people like us that like objective games, you know, we we're a lot of the people that play it are actually rushers. But then again, we do have that those rushers that become campers or those campers that are just campers and piss everybody off. Uh, so, you know, I, I I think that that they're they're kind of realizing that a lot of the stuff they did in the beginning is kind of fucked up. So now they're kind of trying to I guess soften things up before the game's dead. Who, who likes that drop shot from the top? I do. Um, anyways, um, I, Treyarch's not my favorite, you know, company, but they tried to, I guess, compensate. Not compensate as in money, but how can I say this? I, I, I guess they try to try to make things better with the gamers because you know the, a lot of gamers are mad about the whole situation here. And uh, for example, you know, a lot of the stuff that's still going on in the beginning of the game, like the hit markers, like you saw that, like the last time I just got killed. I was killing this guy. I'm shooting, I'm shooting, and I get like ten or you know ten hit markers, and I don't get the kill. And and that stuff is just still is still a problem, which I wish Treyarch would fix. Like the stabbing. 
I don't know why people bitch so much about Commando. I mean, seriously, you got a gun, dude. <laughs> you, you know, you should be able to kill somebody with the gun. And uh, I don't think it was such a, a big problem where they had to make fun of it on the on the uh, XP. So uh, th th that's just my my two cents because I, I I like knifing. I mean, there was nothing wrong with knifing. Uh, a lot of the people that I used to knife me, you know, they didn't complain when they knife me, but. You know, when they get knifed on, it's when they complain. Now, I do believe that Ghost and things like that are a problem, especially Second Chance. You know, they're, you're killing somebody, and because, you know, they're on last stand, they shoot you one time with a bullet and you die. Now, that's bullshit, because, you know, most of the time that you're killing somebody, you're shooting them, you know, seven times just to kill them, even with a, with a good gun like the AUG, which is a strong gun, or even the AK, which is a very strong gun. You're shooting him, and then he shoots you once with a damn pistol, and you die. You know... As you can see right there, I just, I think I was recording and I said, oh, I think I should put up my score. <laughs> and I did. Uh, I think I put it up a few times from here and there. Like right there, I think I checked it up again. Uh, in case you guys don't know, when you're recording HDP VR, you have to, it's live, live recording from your TV, uh, which goes to this device called the Hub Hog. And uh, whatever you put on there, whenever you're messing with the screen uh, on your PS3 is what it captures. So if you forget to put the score, then you kind of have to go back and count the whole thing or redo the whole thing, which a lot of people don't like to do once you upload it to your uh, movie editor. Like, mine is iMovies for, for the Mac, so it took me, like, I think to render, uh, upload, I think it was 10 minutes, 15, and I didn't feel like doing that again. But, um, anyways. Anyways, I hope you guys are doing good. Uh, I know that these this, uh, this weekend wasn't, you know, a very celebration type of, you know, uh, weekend because it was a 9-11. And our hearts and prayers goes out to goes out to the families affected on 9/11. Um, you know, it it wasn't a good weekend, but it, it was you know at the same time I think that you know it was a it was a weekend of remorse, but it was also a weekend of you know of accomplishment as an American. I think that uh, I think that in some cases we've came together a little bit more. Here goes a good example right there. I killed him, but he killed me first. Maybe that, that's just. Weird. But anyways, I, I think that you know a lot of in, in a lot of the cases we came closer as Americans and. Uh, it, it didn't. It brought us together, but not really uh, in certain things. Uh, I think it brought us together in a lot of things, but not all. Uh, but like every situation, it comes with good and bad. And I'm not trying to turn this into a political talk or anything because that's not what this you know channel's about. I'm just you know commenting a little bit about you know 9/11 and what our unity became as as a nation. And um, so you know always remember that. You know, any situation, always take, you know, if it's going to take you somewhere, you know, always look for the good. And, and if it brings bad, then try to make the best out of it, you know. And that's the best advice I can give you in, in life. Because it can't always be good. And, I, anyways, I was just, you know, it was just, these were, these were just my two cents on, on that. And, you know, since it was 9-11, I was just bringing that up. And, anyways, you know, and one more thing, guys. I, I, I would really appreciate it if you guys would try to help me out on... Um, you know, whenever you sub, like, and, and favor my videos, that always helps me out and motivates me to do more. And, uh, of course, it gets me on, on, on more credits so I can, you know, be on, on, on the front page for, uh, for YouTube someday. And uh, that's my goal. I want this page to be known. I, I'm trying to help out some members and, of course, you know, people that are interested in, in COD because I'm all about the community. Until then, this is Mickey CTX signing off.